Man United identify long-term Bruno Fernandes replacement As Andre Onana says Manchester United are missing injured star, Manchester United look to be preparing for several transfer windows to come with a unique January opportunity also coming to light. Over the most recent summer window, the Reds signed Joshua Xerxy, Lenny Euro, Mathij De Ligt, Nasser Mazriaiwi and Manuel Ugart all as senior arrivals. As for outgoings, Scott McTominay, Mason Greenwood and Aaron Wan-Bissaka were among those to depart Old Trafford and it looks as though plans have already been set in motion for the coming months. Crystal Palace star Eberechies is now firmly of interest to United with Angel Gomes also being linked to making a stunning return. Exactly where the Reds need to strengthen first is seemingly unclear, however the clash against Palace may have made it clear. For the second time this season, United drew a blank with Marcus Rashford, Joshua Xerxy and Rasmus Hodgland all on the pitch at different moments. Ivan Tony and Jonathan David were two options linked and with the latter staying at Lille, an excellent opportunity to sign him looks to have emerged. According to Italian outlet Calcio Mercato, the Canada international is being looked at by Juventus, and a deal could cost just £12.5 million. Given United's struggles came to the forefront at Selhurst Park, it is a deal worth pursuing if that fee is accurate. As David sees his contract expire in the summer of 2024, an exit being sanctioned at that price is entirely plausible with Lil Keen to receive some funds from their star player. While that move would arrive in the next few months, United also appear to be planning for the long term with a potential Bruno Fernandes replacement being identified. According to a report by Fussball, News RB Salzburg star Oscar Glauck has admirers at United with the view that he could be the successor to Fernandes. The United captain turned 30 earlier this month, and therefore it makes sense for United to be looking bringing in a replacement. Their report also adds that other Premier League clubs are interested, and thus United may have to act quickly if they wish to bring in the 20-year-old Israel international. In other news, Andre Onana says Manchester United are missing injured star. Mana drew 0-0 with Crystal Palace in the Premier League fixture on Saturday evening. Andre Onana was delighted to see Rasmus Hodgland make his injury return for Manchester United in their goalless draw against Crystal Palace on Saturday night and can't wait for Luke Shaw to do the same. The Danish forward featured from the bench as Eric Ten Hag's side were held to a 0-0 draw at Selhurst Park, a result that leaves them bottom half in the Premier League. Hodgland's return should help United to put away the type of big chances they have wasted so far this season, with United still clearly getting back up to speed after the staggered return of a number of players in the summer. United also named Mason Mount on the bench against Palace, while both Victor Lindelof and Tyro Malaysia also returned to training last week after their respective injury layoffs. It means United are now close to having a fully fit squad again, with Lenny Euro and Shaw the only other notable absentees, and Onana can't wait to see the England fullback return seven months since his last appearance for the club. Quizzed on the impact of Hodgland's return, Onana told Sky Sports, he's a key player for us and we are all happy because he's coming back and Malaysia also came back yesterday, so it's important to have everyone back and then the manager will make the choice and we'll be happy with that. We'll have to see this guy on the pitch, but I know he will score important goals for us. We need our guys back. We need Luke Shaw back. I'm happy to see him on the pitch. If you enjoyed the video make sure to smash the like button and make sure to subscribe to Man United Hub to get all the latest updates.